Good morning everybody, this is HMK, Hells Must Tonight, and this is the Let's Play series on Dune in 64-bit mode on a survival world. Now, the devs have done um, an update to the hoppers, so the early recording I did, I've deleted, so I'm going to um, just redo this one. Now, we've made our first hopper, We've got our hopper in the inventory. Now, the placement of your first hopper is very, very important because if you place it on the wrong side, it needs a different setting. So, what you need to do is to make sure that you do not place your first hopper next to your power plant or next to your ore smelter, as this will cause a little bit of difficulties later on when we automate the power supply so what you need to make sure that you do is you put your hopper next to your power supply and your manufacturing plant now I'm not sure if there's any automation into the power plant yet but um, I'm not really too worried about that at the moment so we need to place our hopper here Okay, so first of all, if you press zero or whichever key indicates where your hopper is, you just put it down on the ground. You don't need to add or change any settings to the hopper whatsoever. You can see it's empty. Now, what I've done is I've gone and spent a little bit of time i will put in some power in the ore hopper in the ore extractor sorry I've mined a little bit of ore manually okay so we've got 113 units of ore of coal ore in um, our hopper so what we need to do now is we need to put the coal ore into the invent into the hopper now there's two ways that we can do this there's the long way and there's the quick way and I'm going to show you both ways okay first of all you press R on the hopper to turn on the vacuum and you'll see that it's sucking in the air you then open your inventory you find your coal and what you then do is you press Q and you can see some will come to me and some will go into the hopper you can see it going, going doing that in the bottom left hand corner storage use 34 now that's a long way around um, so what we're going to do is we're going to turn off the vacuum okay and we're going to scroll our mouse on the hot bar until we hit the the coal now this is where the new update has come in um, so thank you very much Dead, for doing this all you need to do now guys is if you can see in the bottom left hand corner it's not quite clear because the work in progress early access um, icon is slightly in the way so I'm going to ask the devs can you just slightly move it out the way a little bit so it's not quite so in the way <laughs> you don't have to of course that's just hoping that you might so basically what you do now guys is you press T and it will automatically add the ore until you've got a hundred units in there that's it. it it's that simple now okay you don't have to throw anything up in the air you don't have to have the vacuum on point to your hopper highlight the item you want in the hopper on your hot bar press the T bang it's in there got no worries now the reason that we want this hopper first on the power supply is because when you open your hub power level um, unfortunately I haven't got any power to show you here so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some power into my um, into my ore as you can see that's a bit low so 
we're, we're just going to fill it up because we do we do need the coal fully drain my battery down take the coal now what we're going to do is we're going to come to our, our storage and we're going to take out the power we're full back on power now but if we now open up this yeah okay it's not going to show me um, but what happens is is when your hub power level is is low yeah it will automatically fill the um, The, the uh, power supply. So let's let's see if we can just do it again. Oops, didn't want that. Wanted to put power in. going to do we're going to take it directly from here and hopefully this will show you why you put the first hopper there because it did work in the last one there you go automatically it puts it in straight away and it starts burning the coal so now you've got your um, hopper and your power plant semi-automated all you need to do make sure is that you've got your coal in your inventory make sure you've got at least a hundred in there and you, you've got power you don't have to go to the hopper you don't have to go to the power plant you can come to the storage power and you can get it from here straight away and it also semi-automates your ore now as well because you've got constant power okay so that's another thing that you've done by just placing the first hopper here next to your manufacturing plant and next to your um, main power source so in the next episode what we're going to do is we're going to automate this so we get continuous coal coming into um, the power into the main power because we don't want our power supply to run out now so thank you very much for watching guys um, hopefully I'll see you on the next episode when we will get this more automated and we will then see what we will do next from there so have fun, stay safe, enjoy the game good work devs Keep it up and I'll see you next time.